Hi guys, um, I just want to show you a quick video of another World War II um, item that's in Birmingham. Uh, myself and the family were being tourists in our own city about three weeks ago and we came to this location which we'll see in a minute further along the canal and basically there was something a bit odd and having investigated it on the internet I found out that it was something that was actually introduced in World War II. So um, I would recommend anybody who's, uh, who lives in a major city and you know you tend to find most of your days you're just running backwards and forwards through it just to take some time with your partner or with family just to just to walk around with um, with no mind of actually going anywhere in particular but just uh, looking around and seeing what you can see something new in in the place where you live so uh, let's uh, just um, walk along the canal now and uh, I'll show you this uh, this thing from uh, as I say that was introduced during World War Two. okay guys so um, this is a good location to try and show you these uh, these items um, I've been watching a youtuber recently called Aqua Jigger and uh, one of his phrases is do you see it do you which I quite like so is there anything here that you think maybe World War Two something that was introduced during World War Two and I'm being a bit, bit of a what's it here because I'm trying to pan around just to make you think that I don't want to make it too obvious I want to make it a bit of fun so as I say me and the family were walking around and uh, and we saw this and uh, and uh, so we just thought well I, I, I asked the family did they know what it might be and uh, they said that uh, we just had a bit of a think and threw out ideas and I suggested something and then I went online and as I say uh, found out that uh, my guess was right so next bit of the video I'll actually show you what it is and here we are so basically what what this design is is uh, the um, the old bridges uh, there was a, a, a lintel put across and then like a, a doorway made um, and then as you can see a, a lintel at the bottom as well almost like a windowsill now I thought these may have been introduced so that uh, fire appliances could put hoses into the canal um, and uh, that is exactly what they are there for and they were introduced during World War II now the reason behind them was um, in an industrial city like Birmingham where everything was packed in so tight if there was a bombing raid and it took out the water mains then there was a ready supply of water uh, to fight fires with the fire appliances from the canals um, but uh, there was a bit of an issue with some of the bridges in the, the, the parapet of the bridge was uh, higher than a person so you couldn't actually see where the hose was uh, was going once you'd thrown it over the wall so they introduced these uh, doorways if you like so they could be opened and then uh, the, the hose could be lowered down into the canal in order that the appliance can um, could fight the fire now when I showed you earlier, the video earlier um, we could see this bridge and I turned around and you could see that other bridge over there yeah so both of these have got these uh, almost like fire doors now uh, there's some over there as well these are quite modern obviously uh, the the old the old ones have obviously been changed um, <clears throat> I would suggest that the ones over in the other bridge there which look like a solid uh, door were what was there originally and as I say they were introduced so that the hose could be passed through and the hose then they were be aware of where the hose was it was actually getting in the water um, and it wasn't uh, catching on a narrowboat either and being dragged along and pulling, <laughs> pulling the, uh, the narrowboat back or pulling the fire appliance into the actual canal so that's my second site for um, Birmingham at war uh, I hope you enjoyed it and uh, what I would ask is uh, if you do ever visit Birmingham come and visit the canals 
around Brindley Place and such like and, uh, and see some of the industrial heritage of uh, Birmingham City Centre. Thanks for watching.